my good friend Paul. So, Paul, um, uh, I, I want to get into electric assist, but before I get into electric assist, uh, tell me a little bit about your background. I, I, I understand you have been, you know, you're, you're quite fit. How do you keep yourself fit? What, what all the activities do you do? I enjoy spending time outdoors, uh, hiking, uh, backpacking, skiing, snowshoeing, mountain climbing, uh, mountain biking. So do a variety of different activities depending on what season or year it is. And how often do you bike? I probably bike uh, once or twice a week. And you do mountain biking? Right? I, I have a, a full suspension mountain bike um, that I primarily like riding uh, up in the mountains, but also uh, do some riding on trail systems in town. Right. And, and you also do quite a bit of hiking? Yes. Yeah. I, I like to go on uh, long distance hikes. And, short day hikes as well. And you have done the 21 day John Muir. Muir. I've, I've hiked the, yes, the John Muir Trail in California. It was one of my favorite uh, hiking experiences. So that's, that's quite an incredible story. You yeah. know, it's it's quite quite amazing. So, um, and you had a chance to try electric assist for the first time. The very uh, first time on, on the Allegheny Passage Trail. And uh, really enjoyed it. It, uh, it uh, you know, allowed me to uh, uh, adjust the level of physical effort that I felt uh, I wanted to exert, and so I could adjust it to, uh, you know, a more uh, standard, uh, unassisted uh, um, position, uh, which was fine for certain settings and certain uh, situations. And then I really enjoyed having the flexibility of uh, increasing the electric assist uh, when we had st steep uphill sections or where it was late in the day and I was getting tired and uh, and didn't feel like uh, pushing myself too hard. Uh, it, uh, it was very nice having that flexibility and, and it was very seamless, uh, very easy to uh, operate and, uh, and uh, it was just a I was impressed with how uh, easy and seamless and helpful it was uh, you know, to help me enjoy my ride. So you, you didn't feel you were being overpowered by the motor or being underpowered by the motor? Did you uh, feel No, you know, you, you can certainly uh, adjust it uh, depending upon your preference and, uh, and it was uh, easy to adjust and That, that flexibility really allowed me to, to uh, uh, adjust it to my personal preference. And do you think uh, electric assist is, is going to be helpful to people, or, or how do you see the future I, uh, having experienced the technology? Yeah, I think the electric assist really uh, would open the door to a lot of people enjoying uh, bike riding. Uh, and certainly, you know, my own casual observations has been that it's been trend uh, uh, giving people access to trail systems that they probably wouldn't normally be uh, able to physically uh, physically perform uh, you know, to enjoy that trail that, that experience but with, the, with the help of uh, electric assist bikes uh, they were able to tackle uh, you know, more uh, aggressive trail systems that they wouldn't otherwise. Yeah. So Paul, how how many miles did you ride the electric assist? So uh, the electric assist I rode uh, along the uh, Allegheny Passage from uh, Rockwood to town, uh, Confluence, uh, which was about 19 miles, and it you know included uh, a variety of trains with some um, you know some uphill uh, sections and, and uh, uh, flat stretches. And we also navigated uh, confluence at, at night. And what, what kind of differences did you observe riding a normal bike versus riding the electric assist? Um, you know, it was a very similar feel, other than it was just uh, much uh, reduced you know, physical exertion, particularly on the uphill, uh, uphill sections. Otherwise, you know, it was indistinguishable uh, on the flat stretches. So it was, it was just extra help. Uh, riding uphill. And uh, what what kind of, uh, uh, what did you feel in terms of your speed, in terms of your enjoyment, in terms of your experience? 
Uh, for me, uh, you know, it was definitely I, I could achieve a higher speed than I would uh, otherwise. Um, and you know, particularly since this was the end of the day of a, of a long, uh, of a long, uh, grueling ride, uh, it, it helped my enjoyment, uh, being able to kind of relax and not uh, exert myself so much. Thank you, Paul. Thank it's you. been it's been wonderful. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah.